Hello everyone, my name is Cammie and welcome to my channel, Cammie's Corner. If you're new to my channel, welcome. And if you're returning, thank you so, so very much for coming back. On my channel, we do mainly Bath & Body Works and fragrance content, which is a little bit of a sprinkle of Disney and lifestyle content. But in today's video, we have a little small Bath & Body Works haul with a little bit of a chit chat tagged along in this happy monday this video is going up on monday because it's going to be the easiest for me to be able to edit and upload by tomorrow i am filming this at like four o'clock on sunday and i still have a couple more hours of work to do on my computer for my job so i had to hurry up and get this video filmed and kind of make it short but simple i'm really hoping i'm not gonna have to make any editing editing things done <laughs> so i can just upload this video, put it in iMovie, add my intro, my outro, and slap it up on YouTube for you guys because I do not want to miss an upload. So I'm going to apologize for the shorter video. However, I will try very hard to at least get four videos out this week. Also, my giveaway may or may not be happening this week. So definitely look forward to that video. But yes, I have a very small $4.95 Fine Fragrance Mist haul. I do have a 25% off coupon. However, I was not going to use a 25% off coupon for just two products. I'm going to say I love my local stores. All of my local stores are amazing. The employees are amazing, but they just never put out product early. So I know a lot of people were able to get that fun new luxurious collection. It's like that rainbow beveled collection as well as like dressed in white and first sight the new like wedding collection my stores didn't have those out i did ask and they're like yeah we can't sell them early unfortunately editing cami here to say that this collection is actually online right now which is super super exciting because only select stores are going to have them in stores at least that's what i was told but it's so exciting to see this collection online Thank you to Sense Galore for pointing this out, but she did say that O oh, Cherry is missing from the website, um, but I'm sure that'll pop up at some point, but this is super exciting because a lot of us just assumed that this was not going to come online because stores were telling us that it was going to be in stores in limited quantities, but I am so, so happy that this collection is going to be online for everyone to be able to shop and get their hands on if they are interested. They are going to come out Monday. So speaking of that little beveled collection, I'll post on the screen. I got this picture courtesy of just Jen. I will link her down in the description below. Jen is amazing. Definitely subscribe to her. But I showed my associates those pictures and she's like, oh my gosh, we do have that collection. It's just not out right now and it's not coming out until Monday. And I am so, so jealous of all of you guys who were able to get it at that $4.95 price point. I know a few people I've seen were able to haul those scents so congratulations to you to get the new new for super super cheap and if you had a 25 percent off coupon these fine fragrance months were like three dollars and 70 cents but anyways she was like and i'm gonna tell you only two stores per region are getting them or per, per district is the word that she said and it was my local store local my local store that's like literally 10 minutes from me is there it is the tiniest little store. They never have anything fun. And like their displays are cute, but they're not as cute as the bigger store that I go to. That's about 25 minutes away. So I prefer to go there. So that store is going to have it. And then a location kind of out by my sister. It's about an hour and 10 minutes away. I don't frequent that that way very often. But if you guys are looking for that beveled collection, I'm going to tell you right now, based on from her information, not every store is getting it, which I know it's so unfortunate. If I'm able, and I won't pay full price, like they come out today, the day you're seeing this, at my local store, and I just won't pay the $18.95. So if I can get them for like maybe $5.95 or even $6.50, I will get all 10 of them that are in the collection and I'll also grab a couple extra for a giveaway for you guys just as a little thank you. And I know it's so sad and it's disappointing when you see this, all these um, Bath & Body Works creators post all these cool collections and then you find out your stores aren't getting them. So I get it's kind of sad and the FOMO is real. Like it's just, you feel bad because you're like, oh my gosh, I want that for my collection. And then you know on Mercari, they're going to be up there for 30, 40 plus dollars and you're going to be like, dang. And you don't want to spend that. So if I can get my hands on a decent sale, I do have a 25% off that expires like April 9th. So there better be some kind of body care sale by then. I will try to buy a few extra for a giveaway to give back for you guys. But anyways, that was just my little chit chat. 
my store does not have any of the new new out unfortunately um but hopefully i can come into stores soon and get it but on the bright side the bridgerton collection did come out today apparently in stores today meaning monday um it is sunday so i don't know did it actually come out i'm not sure but i'm hearing that the bridgerton full collection is going to be out today so that is super exciting for those of you who collect um or who you watch bridgerton and you collect bath and body works that is like the perfect collection for you guys personally i don't know i might buy it I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm on the fence of the Bridgerton collab. But anyways, my long-winded chit-chat out intro is over. Now, onto the haul. So, I did have a body care coupon for a free mini. So, I just picked up Tropidelic. This one smells really good in the, bo in the body care, in the fine fragrance mist. So, I, I like it in the shower gel. I'll definitely have to get a few pieces of this collection. Hopefully, it's 75% off during SAS. And then the two scents I got were Brightest Bloom and Bourbon Strawberry and Vanilla. I might do like little short reviews, like separate videos for people who just want to know what this scent smells like and they can find the review video a little bit easier than watching like a haul video. But I will give you guys my thoughts. In this video, I did not smell either of these, but these were the only like new scents that were on at my store. So the first one we have is Brightest Bloom. This one is $18.95. So it's not reward eligible. This is Lily of the Valley, Jasmine Sambac, or Sambac, excuse me, Garden Carnations, and Fresh Cedarwood. This is, um, it says, build your own bouquet of beauty with a blooming blend of modern florals and crisp, warm woods for a fragrance that feels perfectly picked for you. Super cute. Um, I know this is like super floral. I did smell it already in the wallflower, but I have not sprayed this. It's my first little spritz. I like that. I am really getting that Lily of the Valley incarnations. This is just your perfect spring scent. If you are a floral hater, you're like, I don't want to smell like a bouquet of flowers. This one is not for you. But off of the first sniff, all I'm really getting is Lily of the Valley incarnations. Maybe a little bit of jasmine. There is no cedar wood. I am not getting a lick of cedar wood, which is fine by me. But this is nice. I kind of want to just like spread a little bit on myself. This smells nice. I like that. Now, is it a scent that I feel like I need to run for and grab every form of it? No, but this is really nice, actually. And I don't think we have a scent like this. I don't think this is a repackage. The packaging is beautiful. This would be a really great gift for Mother's Day, FYI. So if there is a sale, this, I think a lot of, um, this would be a really great gift just for Mother's Day, just because the packaging is really pretty and it's floral. So we have that. And then strawberry, bourbon, strawberry, and vanilla. Excuse me. I think I might've called it strawberry, bourbon, and vanilla. This is a repackage of an older scent. And I know it's a fan favorite. I've never smelled this one before, so I was really excited that they brought it back out because I never got to have it when it first came out. But this is Bourbon Vanilla, Garden Strawberry, Apricot Nectar, Pink Jasmine, and White Oak. And of course, it was not reward eligible coming in at $18.95. Let's give it a smell. Again, didn't spray it. I haven't even sprayed it yet. Smelled it, nothing. Uh-oh. <laughs> Wouldn't that be so funny if my sprayers broke? I would actually cry. Oh, here we go. Here it is. They took a lot of sprays. Okay. Oh, this is nice. Wow. Wow. Okay, I want to spray this one directly on my skin and give it a second to dry down because sometimes it smells a little different on your skin just because of your body chemistry. So I'm going to let that dry down while I smell it out of the cap. Wow. That is, that is delicious. This is delicious. It is... It, like the scent notes, it's just strawberry, vanilla, bourbon. I don't really get a floral or an oak note from this. There is a white oak and a jasmine. I'm not really getting that. I'm just getting like a fruity, sweet scent. Wow, this is so nice. Let me smell it now that it's dried on my skin. Yeah, it smells the same on my skin. I love that. Wow. Wow. I'm going to have to pick this up in the shower gel. I think this would be really, really nice as a bubble bath. Wow. That is super nice. For Both of these scents are really good to me. I think Brightest Bloom is like a 7 out of 10. It's really nice. It's very, 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 very floral. A little headache inducing, to be honest. So this would just definitely be like a once in a while kind of scent. And definitely you only need a couple of sprays. This is really strong. 
on the first little sniff. Um, I do like it. It's carnation, lily of the valley. I like a little bit more of like a unique scent and not just a floral, but it is nice. If you're someone that you like basic scents and you're just looking for a floral, I think you will really like Brightest Bloom. And then the bourbon, strawberry, and vanilla. I, I think this is like an eight and a half to nine out of 10. I think it could be a little bit stronger because like smelling it on my hand, to be honest, it's almost gone already. So maybe if you layer it with like the lotion or the body cream, it might last a little bit longer, but I feel like this is a scent that you're going to kind of need to spray a lot of because it's a little bit of a lighter scent, but it is like a sweet vanilla strawberry. I do really like this. Nine out of 10 on the actual scent, but longevity is zero out of 10 because it's almost gone. It's very faint on my skin. But yeah, that was it for my short and sweet and simple little video. I think I made it 10 minutes into the video. And I'm at the end and I don't think I have to make any edits. So I should have no problem getting this video up for you guys. But like I said earlier, definitely, definitely hit that subscribe button because I'm going to have a really exciting giveaway coming out later this week. But that is all for today's video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Comment down below. Let me know what you guys hauled for the $4.95 sale. And let me know your thoughts on the two fragrances that I hauled today. And if you like seeing my face, I'm at the Body Works of Fragrance or Disney content. Make sure you consider hitting that subscribe button because it's free to you. It helps me out so, so much. And you guys can always change your mind later. Thanks again, you guys, for watching today's video. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.